Lincoln Sigish crowd for five years, close on nine and a half thousand, turned up at Sinsel Bank Vince. This would be the last time the Vauxhall Conference League would be flying at the ground. They knew a victory would be enough to regain the Football League place Lincoln lost at the end of last season. Visitors Wick and Wanderers are near the bottom of the league, and they were soon looking second best as Lincoln eagerly went in search of goals. It took Lincoln 26 minutes to get the all-important first goal. David Clark's in-swing corner was backheaded into the net by substitute Mark Sartori, his very first touch of the ball. By half-time, Lincoln fans were getting ready to celebrate, and even news that rivals Barnett were also winning didn't dampen their enthusiasm. Lincoln's second goal, created by Paul Casey's persistence and scored by Phil Brown, set the seal on a famous victory. At the final whistle, you'd have thought that Lincoln had won the cup, never mind regain league status. This is a dream come true. We set the goal at the end of the season. We're going to get up and get over the disappointment and marvellous. So just fantastic. What are the words? Those celebrations naturally continued in the dressing room. It's been a fine achievement by Lincoln's players and their manager, Colin Murphy. It's not been easy, um, but I think that if you um, come to work each day and get things, um, get people working away and kick a few people up the arse and smack a few people over the head, maybe you, um, you deserve it. That was absolutely yeah. superb, yes, superb. As I say, the first time, you know, we've met a lot of them. So well. It's like, nice to get out the first time. You know. Credit to all those management and everything, the supporters. You know, we've made hard work of it, but we're there, that's the main thing anyway. It's been a momentous single season of non-league football for Lincoln. They've erected a new stand, won back their pride and made their loyal fans very happy.